hello guys and welcome back to my channel this is AG update so this video is mainly for those of you participating in the Optra testnet campaign and you are finding it hard to perform some transfer to another wallet maybe sending some ultra token to your friends or maybe sending ultra token to your new wallet and you are getting this error so i'm here to guide you on how you can navigate around this in order to avoid this error so a lot of you are creating new wallets because of security reasons but you are finding it hard to send your token to the new wallet i'm going to show you guys how you can navigate around it and if you are finding it hard to send ultra token to your friends also i'm going to show you guys how you can navigate around this in order to avoid this error so please make sure to watch this video to the end and listen carefully so you don't need any coding skill to know this i'm here to guide you i'm going to explain it like a layman like abcd for you in order for you to understand so please make sure to watch this video to the end because it is going to help you so recently a lot of people came to the discord group that is the Optra discord group and we are complaining that they are finding it hard to make transaction to send Optra token to another wallet so you can see on the screen this is their community head which is bonge he or her brought a solution that you can perform for your transaction to start going smoothly so you can see tx and the client are working again if you're still running into errors replace your cli.py file with the patch one so this is the patch file so i'm going to drop a link to this that is going to help you in order to download this pouch so i'm going to drop it at the description of this video anywhere you're watching this video from so you need to download this first so a lot of people are still finding it hard on how to do this because not everybody have the knowledge of performing something that involves coding like this so i'm going to show you guys so what you just need to do is to just visit here i'm going to drop all the link at the description of this video so you just visit here then open the code space so you can use your Ubuntu to do this. You can use your GitHub terminal, but I prefer using GitHub terminal to perform this. So if you have GitHub account, just click on the link. It's going to take you here. You just click here. Then you click on create code space. You just create code space. Wait for it to process. So what you just need to do now is to visit here again and make sure to bring it down. So I'm just going to show you guys a way that is going to make it simple for you to understand for those of you that don't have the knowledge like this where there is another way you can go about it but this pattern is going to help you so make sure to copy this all right so copy this command you can see option for copy you can see copy make sure to bring it here to the terminal the terminal is going to be like this and make sure to paste this maybe control c sorry for that all right, so make sure to paste this. All right, so make sure it's something like this. Allow, now you click on enter. So wait for it to process. All right. So wait for it to process. All right guys, so you can see on the screen, done. So now what you just need to do is to make sure to download this file. I'm going to drop the link at the description of this video or anywhere you're going to watch it. So it's going to bring you back to this bunch chat in your Discord group for you to copy it directly. Please don't copy anything that you're going to see at the comment section in case someone decided to put a file that is going to compromise your wallet or something. So please don't copy anything. I'm going to drop a direct link to their Discord group by bunch for you to download this file yourself so you can see it or you can visit the discord group under development search for this you are going to see it so after you have done this make sure to download this file so you can see on the screen that i have already downloaded it here now i'm just going to show you guys the next step all right so for the next step what you just need to do now is to click on pre-client click here you are going to see this file here you can see it's cli.py so now what you just need to do is to right click it right click it bring it here then you click on rename so bring it here just use old 
which is old capital letter anyone then you just enter so once you are done what you just need to do now is to click here that is for new file let me see new file and what you need to do is to visit your file now then make sure to copy this okay so i'm going to copy this and bring it back let's do it again for new file now you paste it you're going to see something like this are you sure you want to paste you click on paste all right guys so you're going to see cli.py so in case you want to see this file yeah just make sure to just put your cursor on this ultra quick client then you click on right click then you right click then you click on new file once you click on new file i'm going to see it's going to be above this old one here yeah. but if you click it outside and you paste you're going to see your file here except you just need to take it up here but to make it simpler and easier for you before you paste you come here that is the optra quick client i'm just making this easier for you to understand so you bring it on this ultra pre client right click on it sorry just right click on it then click on new file then make sure to paste the copied file copy from your file explorer then you're going to see it above this I, what you just need to do now is to just click on wallet json click on wallet json and perform the necessary activities like putting down your private key and your address so this is only meant for you this you should not share it with anybody put down this your details after that you are good to go so i place my private key i'm going to increase this now so now what you just need to do is to copy this after pasting your private key copy this now and you visit the this thing again that is the terminal you paste you paste this now after that you click on enter all right guys so it's going to show you something like this so now i'm going to make a transfer for you to see that it has started working for those of you that are finding it hard to make transfer so you are going to see that it's not going to show you error again so i'm just going to click on one all right so now paste the address put down the amount that you want to send like I'll be sending maybe three. Click on it, then click here, then click Y, then click on Enter. So wait for it to process. All right, guys. So looking on the screen, transaction successful. So this is how you can solve the error issue for those of you finding it hard to make some transfer. So in case you don't know how to put the pouch on your ultra client terminal, this is how you can process it it's very easy to perform so the video is going to be long due to my explanation but this is how you can do it so i've explained it in the layman way for you to understand now is to follow the process make sure to watch the video carefully and also share this video to your friends because it's going to help them in doing this as well so for those of you that participated in the ultra testnet campaign and you imported your ultra wallet into any third party wallet or so maybe someone from the community decided to create an ultra wallet that is going to help the community in order to make it easier for you to perform ultra transaction it is advisable you create a new ultra wallet then send your token to that wallet it's going to help you guys in order to avoid I know so please just make sure to use the normal ultra terminal method to create a new wallet and avoid that wallet for some time although some wallets are claiming to be legit and you don't have access to your phrase and the rest but in order to avoid a dino please make sure to just avoid those wallets as a sign of making this video create a new wallet send all your phones there because a lot of people have started complaining that their ultra are missing if you know you created a respiratory, make sure to also set it to private. It's going to help you. My next video on Optra, I'm going to explain that as well because Punch posted something about that recently. So this is what they are going to see in the announcement group on 
this code all right guys so this is how you can solve your transaction error issue for those of you that want to send out your ultra token to another wallet so i'll be making different videos on ultra very soon how you can know your ultra location how you can avoid scammers or hackers from your wallet in order to make it safe the safest way is to just create a new wallet and please don't set it on public that is if you are doing respiratory or you can use maybe the normal ultra pattern also if you will just visit the pre client use this pattern that I just use is going to still be safe. What you need to know again is that Ultra is going to start its ICO on the 18th of December 2025 and it's going to end on the 25th of December 2025. So its ICO price is $0.2 for those of you that want to participate in it. So you can see this post was from Ultra and you can see, hey guys, the ICO days are away and we recommend registering with Echo dot xyz so avoid missing out on this registration you can register here perform kyc so you are going to receive an email reminder 24 hours ahead with the instruction on how to receive your private token after the ico concluded so please make sure to register and also make sure you perform the necessary kyc and the rest so are you going to participate in the ultra ico i would love to hear from you on what you think about this at the comment section all right guys and this is ag update your friend in crypto thank you guys and minimal greens to your wallet